If they were going to try to destroy you, you got every right to destroy that. Who was suing you? Who's prosecuting you? Florida? Or was it the county? Was it like, oh, was it Volusia County? Because I used to, I, I, I think he did that in Sanford, which is just uh, a little west of uh, Daytona and east of uh, Altamont Springs and uh, Orlando. So yeah, sue Volusia County. Sue them for every dime they got. I don't know if the state sued them or the county sued them. The county prosecuted them. Take the county for all they got, because that's what they were trying to do to him. They were trying to take everything that he had. They were trying to get him murder one or whatever. They destroyed his world. He has every right to destroy their world. That's the very last chapter of the Iliad and the Odyssey. That's how the king decided how the other kings were that fate was going to be met. They tried to destroy his world. He destroyed their world. It's that. It's been an ancient rite, an ancient ritual since mankind began. They shouldn't have made a false claim against that man and destroyed his life. And he was found not guilty by a trial of, by a jury. You gotta you gotta compensate the man now. He just wants legal fees, like three hundred thousand dollars. Please. He could ask for gazillions, and I'd like to see somebody tell him no that he don't deserve it. What what if they did that to Donald Trump? What if they did that to Bill Gates? What if they did that to Warren Buffett? These guys work billions. What do you think these guys would sell for three hundred thousand dollars? What makes Warren Buffett's life any more valuable than uh, Zimmerman's life or O.J. Simpson's life? Nothing. So it's interesting. It's interesting how I would uh, love to talk to Zimmerman or O.J. Simpson. <laughs> I had fun. <laughs> Maybe they'd understand what I was doing. and say, holy crap, you're right. They'd say, hey, you want to read the Iliad and the Odyssey? Well, hell, let's just skip to the last chapter. <laughs> Well, like I said, it's very simple, man. More is very simple. It's been the same way for tens of thousands of years, man. Nothing's changed since caveman time. Nothing. I love reading the stuff from like 1500s and 1600s. And they'll say, it, they actually say that, like if you read Cook or Littleton, they'll actually say in these modern times, you're looking at like 1490, you know, when they still thought the world was flat. In these modern times, we at the law society, our legal society, believe, it's like, oh, Jesus, in these modern times, <laughs> 1490, yeah, didn't you guys still think the world was flat? <laughs> so it's funny when you hear that everybody thinks that their society is the enlightened society and the cultural elite and everybody who's sitting on a bench are the supreme smartest people on a planet. And then you go, oh my God. You know what, basically though, all the rights and all the wrongs have always basically stayed the same. Doing wrong is always wrong. Doing, you know, doing the wrong thing, there's always some sort of consequences of compensation do.